All right, guys, it's DJ here. Welcome back to my channel. This video was a little delayed, but here we go with episode three of Pretty Little Liars. All right, let's just jump right into this. Pray I get this in on time. I'm meeting someone for lunch right now, so I have like 15 minutes to record this video. So we're gonna burn right through these little hoes. All righty. It's best experience with the sound on. Oh, well, I look damn depressed. Oh, we're I forgot we're escaping to go to the barn party, y'all. Okay, here we go. Oh, we pop in, we dancing, we having a blast. We on our cell phone. We drinking. Oop, bottoms up. Oh, she's fierce. Who is she? And then it zooms to us. <laughs> Oh, look, it's my squad, which I am the odd one out since I didn't have enough money to buy the cute outfit. So I look like a flop. There you are. DJ, you okay? What happened? I was broke. That's what happened, Spencer. A was in my bedroom. <gasps> Shocked gasp. She left a note on my mirror. Okay, A's taken it too far. Now you think A's taken it too far? <laughs> like, it's been too far, girl. Breaking into our bedrooms. Like, why was my bedroom the one that took it too far? But you know what? I'll take it. You didn't even have time to do your hair. Same, right, sis? Like, the real tragedy here. Uh, Han, I don't think that's the point. Also, Han, thanks for the shade to my hairstyle. I think it looks great. How come you didn't wear A's dress? Um, because y'all made me buy this and I was too broke. I'm sorry guys, but I thought it was creepy. AKA, like in my head, I'm just like, cause I'm poor. She's dressing us up like dolls. Cute ass dolls, buzz buzz. Let's play a game of truth or dare, liars. Obey and you find me. Refuse and you pay. Pay as in pay like, you know, like something's gonna happen to us or literally pay because First dare, change back into your regular outfit. Since DJ disobeyed me, you're not worthy of my dresses anymore. <laughs> uh, I'm just setting trends here. This is nuts. We need to find A before this gets too crazy. Let's split up. Girl, the worst idea. DJ, let's go. Now oh, I get Hannah with us. Ooh, dance, dance, dance. All right, let's see what's up. Let's just, can we just get a drink? Because I think we need, oh, I see Hannah just has a little switch here. Hannah, I really need to talk to you. I can't right now. Seriously, Hannah, it's important. Okay, give me 10 minutes. Buzz, buzz. <gasps> no way. <laughs> what did she say? Hefty Hannah, you looked sexy in that red dress, but you aren't wearing it now. So I have a treat in store for you. See those cupcakes on the table? I dare you to eat them all. <laughs> what? I won't do it. My binging days are over. Oh my god. She says she'll tell the police about the stuff I stole. First, Allie teaches me how to throw out my food, and now she's making me eat. Hannah, I could come with you. Thanks, but you should find Brian. I'll be okay. Ooh. Oh, Hannah, no, girl. Oh, no. She's going for those cupcakes. Oh, I feel so bad for her. This is awful. Girl, I know. At first I thought it was funny, but now just seeing her having to, like, force those cupcakes down her throat, I feel so bad. Allie's taking it too far. DJ. Oh, sexy. What's up, Brian? There you are. You know I've been here. I've been, you know. I'm so happy you made it. You too. Everything okay? Um, not really. <laughs> now you see what happens when you disobey me, liar. If you want to find me, you have to break his heart. No. Tell him you wish he'd never come to Rosewood. Oh my God. Every inch of me just wants to kiss him. I can't break his heart. Seriously, DJ, are you okay? Wait, I could protect him from A. I just need to sneak him somewhere private. Oh my gosh. Ugh, this is the worst. I just have to break his heart. 
Brian, we, we shouldn't be talking. What, why? Do it, liar. Tell him, now. You sure you're okay, Brian? I, I wish you'd never come to Rosewood. DJ, what are you saying? Please go. This isn't you talking what's going on. You and me, it's never gonna happen. Stop, this is, no, you stop, Brian. You, you should stay away from me. Wait, DJ. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm like actually sad about that. Like, <laughs> Brian was so hot. Like, why these bitches gotta have so many damn secrets? You think that's the worst I can do? You haven't seen anything yet. I found the letter tucked away in your locket. That's quite a confession. How would you feel if I sent the juicy details to Brian? You cracked his heart, but I can shatter it to pieces. Oh my god. I was so angry when I wrote that. Oh, it's not the whole story. Okay. Okay, we got this. We're starting to learn more about a secret that, you know, I don't even know about here. Mona, what's wrong? I need to talk to you. It's urgent. What's going on? Your locket. I know where it is. My locket? How do you know about my locket? Why is my locket just being everywhere in this city? Have you been texting me? I've been getting texts too. I can help you. Follow me and I'll get your locket back. Oh my gosh, this is so traumatic. <laughs> Honestly, y'all. <laughs> Okay, we're just gonna have to let it keep the locket. Good luck. This is the worst. Honestly, I'm about to buy. Oh gosh. Emily and Maya kissing? Emily's mom should know what her daughter is up to. Dare, put the photos under the flower pot outside, or I send Brian your confession. You know what? I'm gonna be a good friend here. I'm just gonna be a good friend. I'm not gonna do that. I'm sorry. Look at me, I am such a good friend up in here. Buzz buzz. Oh, is Brian about- <laughs> Oh no, Brian just got the letter. <laughs> what did A tell him? DJ, Spencer found something. Sorry guys, I had like no commentary there for a minute because I was just shocked at the story too. Look at that. There's a present, y'all. I love presents. Let's see what this present is. It must be from Allie. Like, are we even sure this is Allie? Did I miss something here? What? That's Mona's scarf. Wait, what? Mona's? Oh gosh. Is Mona a... Guys! The Delorentis house. Something's happening. We have to get to Allie's. Let's go. Wait, Mona... Was Mona okay, though? I'm so shocked. Is Mona, like, slayed? Oh my gosh, what is going on here? Who, who's that? Okay, y'all, we're having a disaster here. Disaster at the De Laurentiis. All right, yeah, let's all walk up. Let's walk up, you know. Maya. I was gonna say, sorry, miss. This is a crime scene. She's my friend. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Get back here. Emily, I thought something might have happened to you. I tried to call you. What's going on? Emily, I'm so sorry. They found a body. Oh my God. Ooh, this is getting crazy. Was it, what's her name? Who is it? Emily, I... I don't know how to say this. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. My heart, y'all. Who is this? Who is this? I'm just, I'm shook. I'm so shook. This was a short episode, but I am so shook. Oh, I just hit my glass. Sorry about that, y'all. All right, y'all. We're going to end it here. And then we are going to get episode four really, really soon. Like, I'm going to film this a little later today. So hopefully it'll be up in the next day or two here. I am so ready for episode four. Let's see what happens. Guys, I'm honestly tempted to buy diamonds because I want those good options. I'm actually going to research if, like, these 
like options are going I know like that you make different decisions and they can like affect outcomes and endings but I want to see if it really affects stuff because I kind of want to buy the diamonds all right guys have a wonderful day like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and yeah catch you in the next one